Today, we will try out the GPTQ Llama 2 model from the bloke's repository on Hugging Face. We will use these instructions on the bloke's model page to run it with Ooga Booga. If you don't already have Ooga Booga, it is pretty straightforward to install. Simply go to the Ooga Booga GitHub page, scroll down and download and extract the zip. Done! First, we want to make sure we have the latest version of Ooga Booga. I'm going to go into the directory where I extracted the Ooga Booga zip file and run the update underscore Windows batch file. Once that is done, you can press the any key on your keyboard. Which one is the any key? I have no idea. Anyways, now let's start Ooga Booga by running the start underscore Windows batch file. I received this error message, something about pydantic fields. If you also get this error, there is a solution from the creator from Ooga Booga. It says this error is caused by using an outdated installer, and we can use this updated web UI Python file. I'm going to go to my installation directory and locate the existing web UI Python file. Then let's open this new one in a new tab and download it, and then replace my existing one with this newly downloaded one. Now let's go to the prompt and press the any key to exit. The solution says to now run the update again after replacing that Python file. Once that is done, we can press the any key to exit. Now let's try starting Ooga Booga again and let's see if it works. Nice, it worked. I'm going to smash that like button on the solution. I mean the heart button. Now let's copy that URL to a new browser window. And now let's go back to the bloke's instructions. Step one is to click on the model tab. So let's click on the model tab. Step two is to enter that text for the download custom model or LoRa text box. I'm just going to copy paste it. Step three is to click download. It is done. Step 4 confirms it is done. Step 5 is to click the refresh icon next to model. Step 6 is to select that newly downloaded GPTQ model from the drop down. I'm going to click the drop down and select the bloke's Llama 2 chat GPTQ. Step 7 says it is now loaded and ready to use. Step 8 mentions we can save any custom settings we want to make. And step 9 is to click the text generation tab and enter a prompt to get started. I'm just going to click on save settings to save these default settings. And then let's go to the text generation tab to test this out. I'm going to ask it about ducks. Let's ask it what a duck sounds like. I clicked Generate, but there doesn't seem to be anything happening. Looks like we got an error. Oops, I forgot to load the model. We need to add another step to actually click the Load button. Now it will take a while to load this model. We can see the status on the bottom right on this UI. It finished. That actually didn't take too long. Now let's try out a prompt again and ask something about ducks. This is moving in real time. It is going pretty fast. I remember the original Llama 7B model took a long time. This is definitely faster. It is finished. It took 8.27 seconds. Great. Now, as a test for comparison, I'm going to load the original non-quantized 7B model. It has finished loading. Now, let's try it out with the exact same prompt and let's see how long it takes. Spoiler alert, this took a very long time. During the time it took to run this, I wondered if it was the right choice to conduct this test. 
Several times I considered stopping the application. It used up all of the RAM and my OBS eventually crashed. It finally finished. It took 2,317 seconds compared to the quantized, which only took 8 seconds. The tokens per second for this one was only 0.04, where for the quantized, it was 11.37. That is over 284 times faster with the quantized model. The screen just went blank. That is because my OBS crashed during this process with the original 7B model and refused to stop recording from this screen. So anyways, I will be deleting the original models and only using the ones from the bloke's hugging face repository moving forward for the ones I use locally. That is all. Enjoy. P.S. Let me know if anyone figures out which key is the any key.